I just wanted to show you some proactive, common sense ways that you can practice good hygiene, health, and safety at the J. Come on. One of the first things that you can do directly after you enter the J, especially since you've just opened the door, is use one of our hand sanitation stations or go immediately to the restroom and wash your hands. So right now my hands are still dirty, so it's okay to touch the faucet. It's also okay to touch this nozzle even if there are germs on it because now I'm gonna begin washing my hands. All right, we're gonna wash the wrists, the back of the hand, the palm, in between the fingers, in between the fingernails, everywhere. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna scrub away for 20 seconds at least. So that doesn't have to be the traditional happy birthday to you song. It could be the chorus of one of your favorite songs. So baby, you're a firework. Go ahead and let your colors work. Don't know the song's lyrics, but that's okay. I'm gonna wash these germs away. So at this point, my hands are clean. What I'm gonna do, instead of touching that faucet, I'm gonna take the paper towel. And then I'm gonna use the paper towel as a barrier. You're gonna keep the paper towel that you just used to dry your hands. If there is a handle, you just use the towel to push the door open. If there's no handle, but it's a swing open door, that's okay. Just use your rear, walk out, on your way. In terms of using tissues here in our facilities, that's totally fine, but let me show you one of the biggest no-nos. Now let me show you one of the biggest yes, yeses. <laughs> St. Louis J locations have sanitation stations where you can get our simple green industrial solution that is not only antiviral, it's antimicrobial, and antibacterial. How you'd use this solution is you would saturate the blue towel with the solution. And the way I would describe this is the germs, virus, microbes, they're all gonna be like ice cubes and this solution on this cloth is gonna be like a wildfire. You wanna be sure to wipe down every surface that somebody may have touched and you maybe will touch. So that includes handrails, heart rate grips, buttons to increase speeds, inclines, and then also this, this touch screen display. When it comes to our weight training machines, you wanna make sure that you are wiping down any area of the machine that your head, face, hands, and maybe even some of your stuff will be touching. So that includes this area where your head would be resting, down here by the hand grips, both under and on top of it, both sides. And then on our new Life Fitness machines, anything that is orange, adjust the machine, which is where other people and you will have touched. Here, here as well, underneath there. And then on top, if you put your stuff up in these trays, be a good idea to wipe that down as well. Again, 30 to 60 seconds, not too much time. And just so you know, these blue towels are being swapped out by our JCC staff hourly to keep fresh towels available for use. If these blue towels are not the option for you, you are more than welcome to use our paper towel stations as well in the very, very similar way on our equipment. Just remember that at the J, we literally have hand sanitizer all over the place to help keep you and others as healthy as possible. 
For years, it's been pretty commonplace for yoga and Pilates and any mind-body participants to bring their own mats to class. I want to let you know that it's totally acceptable for you to bring your own mat to any of our group exercise classes. You are more than welcome to continue to use the JCC's provided exercise mats. However, I would take into consideration cleaning the mats pre and post class with one of our cleaning solutions and just wiping it down thoroughly on both sides. On behalf of the J, thank you so much for helping us do a better job at keeping our facilities as clean and healthy as possible. We can do this better together. Thank you so much.